Hello, hello! Good morning mga langga! Good morning! Welcome back sa akin channel! Today is Saturday here! So, Anika is eating her breakfast. Anika is not feeling well. She has fever. Hi, Daddy! Good morning! Yes, hello, good morning also. Good morning! Yes, she has, she has a fever last night. So, she's not feeling well. Um, she have a running nose also so about today another day another vlog so now i am in the kitchen again preparing the food or i was defrost this food last night already because it's frozen but i have no choice we have no choice because we are far from philippines but we miss sometimes the philippine food so today we have a quadruplet celebration of birthday celebration for the agustinian so we are contributing food to have a party in the place of my friend so uh, i'm very sorry because um, I'm going to start to speak English in my blog because some of my subscribers from here in Europe said that they cannot understand what I'm saying on my blog. That's why he cannot they, are, they cannot continue to watch my blog. So sorry. If I'm going to speak English, I'll try my I'll try my best to speak English because I'll tried also my best to have to translate the text on my videos, but. It's not coming out and it takes a lot of time. So now I'll try my best to speak English, okay? So I'll be uh, sorry if I speak not very well because I'm not an um, English speaker. Um, I'm not used to, to speak English. Anyway, we speak English here in, in the house, but I only have Carabao English. <laughs> So, I'm going to show you what is the fish that I bought. Yeah, and this one. So, this is the fish that I bought. And we call this fish there in our country in Philippines. This is Bilong Bilong. So, I miss this fish. Um, this is good for paxio or sour um, cooking with the vinegar. But this time, i just going to fried this one because we have we are planning to have a bottle fight with the friends so let's see later kung anong itsura niyan what's, what it looks like because it, this is frozen, this is not fresh but anyway it's okay so update ko kayo later I will update you later I'm also going to cook a so ayan now i am preparing the vegetable this is the string beans we call this baguio beans all beans and the better melon and heart there are the others this is the eggplant and the okra so i wash it first very well before i'm going to cut everything so yung fish natin nakamarinate na siya sa asin so later i'm going to fry that one so and now this is the preparation of the vegetable yeah and veggies tayo we are now eating veggies so that we are healthy so i'm not going to mix that with meat that's only all about the veggies so i also have this one here this one i'm going also to mix that all the veggies so let's see later how it goes so ayan po nahiwa ko na po yung ating mga gulay ayan so yung talong nakapunosin ko yan kasi para hindi masira ayan so igigisa ko lang yan yun yung ampalaya so gagawin ko sana yung pakbit kasi wala naman akong kasula akong bagoong so yan prepare na siya so iluluto na lang natin update na lang later kapag naluto na at 
tsaka ano pala, nagprito na pala ako ng isda. Ayun, pinirito ko na siya. Tapos, andito na rin yung kanyang mga ibang naluto ko na. So, ayan na yun si Bilong-Bilong. Sarap! Hope mag-enjoy kayo! Now, cooking the vegetables. We are frying the squash. Then after this one, we're gonna put all of that, some other ingredients there, that one, so. Now we are frying this first. Then I leave this for a little bit, maybe three minutes. Then after I put the other ingredients, okay? So a bit later. I put the better meal on. Yeah. Put the better meal on. And I put all the green vegetable, the beans, and the okra. So, Daddy, come here. Yeah, and hopefully now, monkey. They are fit here. All of this. Yeah. And now I put the okra. Oh my god, it's not fit all too much. the vegetable okay. then I mix it then I put the eggplant later so yan I'm going to halo halo and mix and mix <laughs> just like that and this is I think after 10 minutes this is ready I'm just going to make it soft in a little bit So, update later. Now, I'm cooking humba for the party because we have another trifle quadruplets. <laughs> quadruplets birthday celebration. So, I promise to bring humba and four dishes vegetables. So, later, I'm gonna cook the others. Enjoy watching mga langga. Hopefully, this will be taste good. We call this in Philippines humba pinahilisan. Ayan. Nalagyan ko na siya. I put already there. Most data or the spices, so I put already the soya banana leaf. This one I put in Tagalog, ano bulaklak ng saging. So the twist of this is I will show you what's the twist of my humba later. So I will put some ingredients there also so we will see ayan so ayan na po nilagay ko na po siya dito i put it here so after here yan yung takip niya that's the then i'm gonna put this one to the oven the oven i put it ready so i just put it for 
maybe 130, 110, 130, then you will see. To make it soft. Actually, this is already soft, but this is the twist of my humba after I put it in the oven. So hopefully this taste tastes good. This is the first time I try this one. Someone is introducing this to me, but I will try. And hopefully this will be yummy, yummy. Yeah. So I just put it there while waiting our oven to be ready. So after I remove this from the oven, this one later, so I will be put the black beans, this one. So I just mix that one a little bit, not many. Not too much. Now it's already in the oven, so we will see. It's not clear because the glass of the oven is not that clear, also. So need to clean. Ayan po. In um, I put out it from the oven here, but I will put it back later because I just put the black beans. So this is my twist. Like I said, that I have, I am going to have a twist on this humba of mine. This is Annika's favorite. So let's see after I put the black beans. I put it uh, two hours for 110 to 120 degrees Celsius, so that it will be really, really soft. 